Yeah, I'm looking forward to P, 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 P10. Um, it'll be another challenge. I've obviously done all nine before, so this one will be uh, the chairman's choice with made by Cooper. It's going to be a tough one, but uh, but yeah, I've, I've, over the years I've always left my training a little bit too late, so uh, I'm going to start early with the help of Cal, I think. We've got a bit of a challenge today with some of the partners and then we've got spinning classes so um, that have a, a, been arranged from now until Pedal Bounce 10. So for me it's a great way to get everybody together, get the momentum going for number 10 which is going to be a special one of course. Getting close to, to 2 million I think is just demonstrates how big Pedal for Pounds has become. So, so, you know, th just think about that for a minute, 2 million pounds over the past 10 years is a phenomenal achievement that's been made by you know the supporters of pedal for pounds the sponsors of pedal for pounds the cyclists the support staff i think the whole club has kind of come together and created something really really special and for me to raise that kind of money to keep the helicopters and support local charities as well is, is, is what makes us Huddersfield Town, the Terriers and people like Cal and everybody involved really, really special. We come together on match days, so why don't we come together uh, when we're doing a bit of training ready for Ped of Pounds 10. So I think we've got uh, a spinning class this evening, so loads of people coming together, great fun. Uh, and as we are, we're all in it together. Everything that we do as a football club involves all the different people, so we do it in different ways. It's fantastic. To be honest, I've always wanted to do Pedal for Pounds. Um, it's something that's always appealed to me, but I've not always had the time uh, or the motivation. Um, and recently, kind of, I met with Sean at a different event and he convinced me that it might be a good thing to do. So in Dean We Trust, it sounds like a great route. Why not? Let's go for it. Let's have a bit of fun. Let's make, uh, make some money for a great cause. And I'm really looking forward to it. I'm motivated every year to do something that challenges me physically. I've done runs in the past, I've done swims, so I thought I should complete the triathlon. So uh, Pedal Pounds kind of makes sense as a personal challenge for me. I speak to so many club partners who have done different Pedal for Pounds in the past. Some have done a couple, some have done all of them. Uh, and it's just going to be wonderful to be part of that kind of network and, and make some great friends uh, and get to do it all together. Yeah, um, Kirkley's Acts of Leisure were really keen to get on board with the project. Obviously it's raising a lot of money and has done in the, the past as well. Um, for local charities, so it's good that we get involved with this as well. On board for the long journey that's ahead of all the cyclists um, coming up in April and May, um, and we're preparing the training in that respect as well. So we've got um, a little bit of a, a show on tonight as well with the Watt bikes, but we've also got as well as additional classes that are running that the cyclists can attend. There's some on a Thursday night, 8 till 9 o'clock, and there's going to be some on some home games um, prior to the match starting. One, uh, 12 till 1 o'clock. I'm going to say as well, we are going to be looking at uh, doing some educational material as well. So we're going to try and do some monthly newsletters and recipes and things as well. Um, so getting people to know to start your training early, don't leave it too late, use them classes um, and hopefully we can be there with every step of the way in your challenge.